in the previous video we discussed about the null vectors which is also known as zero vectors all right and those vectors which has the magnitude zero are called uh, zero vectors or null vectors now let's learn equal vectors equal vectors from the name itself it is very clear vectors having the equal magnitude and equal uh, direction so you can say same direction are called equal vectors all right so let's say i have a vector uh, vector a and i have vector b okay so uh, let's let me draw here vector a uh, this is vector a okay and let's say vector this a is starting at this point and ending at this point okay so this exactly same measurement you know this exactly same measurement I'm going to make here all right this is the exact measurement all right and you know the distance between these two points this exactly you know this measurement uh, let me do with the with the yellow color this yellow colored length and this yellow colored length both have the same length both have the same size both have the same length all right so any two vectors having the same magnitude means magnitude of a and magnitude of b are equal all right i mean to say magnitude of a is equal with magnitude of b and same direction all right same direction if they have same direction let me say the direction of a and direction of b both are same then that time vector a and vector b are called equal vectors okay so vector a is said to be vector b equals to vector b if a magnitude of a is equal with magnitude of b and have same direction have same direction all right and uh, there are many ways to represent this all right i mean you may displace one vector with another vector but you should not dis uh, you should not uh, alter the size all right you should not alter the length of that vectors okay let's let's say this is vector a all right this is vector a and of the same size in the same direction all right i have vector b so here this length is same and the direction is also same so i can say that vector a is equal to vector b and you know you can displace the position that is not fixed i mean you can you can you can place this b here also you can you can write this b here also let's say from here to here this is vector b all right does not need that we need to just write below that or just above that all right you can even write parallel anywhere you know let's say this is also vector b let's say this is vector b here all right this is here vector a is here and vector b is here both have the same magnitude and the same direction so that time also these 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 vectors are uh, uh, equal all right no matter where you're placing but direction and the magnitude must be equal all right you can write anywhere let's say this is this is vector c and here i have vector d let's say here i have vector d if both vector c and vector d have same magnitude and same direction all right these are parallel looking so these are equal i can say vector c is equal to vector d if the magnitude and the direction are same all right no matter what you're placing it more example if you want to take then let me show you in the graph uh let's say this is x-axis and this is y-axis all right let me uh, draw one two three four five six all right and then one two three four five okay let's say i have a vector uh that starts from this point p and let's say it is going to end with point q all right so this is my vector pq all right that is directed from p to q all right in the direction of x axis okay parallel to x axis uh let's say i have one more vector uh let's say i have vector here okay let's say this is a and one two all right two this is p so vector this a b okay vector a b now vector a b has magnitude of two unit length you know these two unit length these two units you know let's say this is two unit and similarly if you see the magnitude of pq that is also two all right so here it is here and it is at another place but both have the same direction which is parallel to axis this is also parallel to x axis so here here vector pq i can say is parallel uh, is parallel to av definitely and is equals to vector ab because both have the same magnitude or both have the same direction similarly it may be like this you know maybe like this maybe anyhow you know but both lines should be parallel so from here you can say that two vectors is either either parallel to each other or or maybe co-initial you know if one is vector there 
and 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 if this is one vector then another vector will be just maybe over that all right so maybe maybe uh, collinear or maybe parallel so so equal vectors are always parallel or coinitial you can say simply these are parallels all right because co these collinears are also a case of parallel all right where both are merging that's it so equal vectors those vectors having same magnitude and same direction 